Hello everybody. Welcome to um to, to this video. Uh I don't really Yeah, I don't know. It's a test video. Um as you may have noticed, well maybe you haven't I don't know how YouTube actually works when you do this stuff. Um this video is recorded in 2560 by 1440 resolution now whether that's UHD or if you want to call that 2k or what I I don't know man the important thing is it's it's nice and high resolution um, and like I said this is just a test so I'm this may never even end up on YouTube which is was actually a really stupid thing to say because obviously if you're watching this it was put on YouTube but I don't know how editing is gonna work obviously by the time this goes on YouTube it will have been edited and exported and all that good stuff so I'm basically just wandering around for a few minutes oh you know what? I forgot to heavily increase the bitrate that I'm recording at so this is probably gonna look like garbage I should have should have thought about that before I started recording I should probably be filmed at a much higher bit rate than what I normally use because I don't know what the number of pixels more there is because this is the higher resolution but it's definitely more pixels than uh, you know, standard HD 1920 by 1080. So I should have bumped up my bitrate before starting to record. Yeah, that that would have been smart. Oh well, it may turn out okay. Um, but this is just at whatever the normal. Oh, I don't want to go that way. Normal level was. I'll be back in a little bit on another server. Um, with a higher bitrate, and I'll. I'll just use both sets of footage together and I'll edit them and yeah, we'll we'll see how it, we'll see how it works out. So let's hop on over to the Luna Techath server where uh, I have this nice little base. I've been doing a let's play series on here, so um if you're interested in that, yeah, yeah go go check it out. I've also been doing videos on inside the box, so if you're interested in those, definitely check those out too. This is my most recent um thing i guess essentially what we have here is a battery and a no detector and this detector is looking for battery box eight which a fully charged battery is number eight it just basically is the uh like this gauge on the side showing how full it is and then we have a not gate so this sends a positive signal when it's finding box eight so right now this is sending a positive signal the not gate changes it to the inverse or uh, to a negative, pretty much. And then this is, I want to say this is an AND gate. So when both of these are positive, it sends a signal to the item wise item injector thing, filter injector, which then sends something through this tube to a fuel fire generator. And uh, essentially, it burns leaves to make electricity. It'll probably never actually run because I have um, two solar cells and then I have a windmill way up there. And that windmill, right now the solar power will not be producing any electricity because it's nighttime. That windmill provides 4,300. That's one windmill. Kind of OP. So, um, yeah. Oh, hey! I have grass again! The, uh, the winter event that turned grass to snow is finished. Beautimus. I got to plant things in these, but nobody really cares about that. This really isn't about this anyways. It's more just uh, testing. Here's my house. Needs to be furnished yet. Two bedrooms. Upstairs. Um, I got to put some shutters on these back windows yet. They automatically close at night. Pretty neat. Um, little porch patio thing up here it still needs a roof too like I don't want to just leave it with a flat roof forever 
so that needs to be done. Um, underneath the stairs, here's uh, a little bathroom. Uh, this needs a lot of work yet, but I don't know what I want to do because of the windows and stuff. But yeah, that's that. Um, and then we have the kitchen and dining room area. Uh, it needs to be furnished yet with some, obviously, tables and chairs. Stuff, and then the little... I call it a workshop, but it's not really a workshop. I have my anvil, table saw, all my storage. You know, things like that. And yeah, so that's that's kind of that. Um, like I said, it really isn't about anything here. It's more, it's more about filming at this super high resolution and seeing if my bit rates are good and because I'm sure they need tweaking this is a horrible way to go down when I have a uh, wait what's going on over here I may need to check this out I have a bunch of water leaking someplace this isn't good where is this water coming from and why it's unfortunate that it's always so dark. Oh wait, here it is. Well, why is there an opening in this? Do I have any cobble on me? No, of course I don't. Because why would I? No worries though, I have some backpacks. What do I have in my backpacks? Probably nothing that's useful, but... Okay, great. Let's use my bacon pickaxe. Oh, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's one of these guys. The Headless Bacon Men. This is a horrible thing to do for demo video because it's all dark. So you, yeah, I don't know if I have a, a good bit rate or not. Okay, we, we use the bacon pickaxe to get some cobble. Let's patch these holes up. Is that going to fix all of the water flow? I don't know. Also, why do I not have any torches? Oh, I actually don't have any torches. That's surprising. Okay, well again, it's dark, so we can't really see, but I think the water is receding from this side. I thought that was water on that side, but that's just stones. The only water that should be here is my water elevator, which just goes from here down. And actually, I may as well get rid of this too, because now that I think of it, I have some travel nets, so there's no need for this. It's pointless. Completely pointless. If you want to travel places, you just uh, find the way out of the house. Run over here. Say, oh, let's update this. Say, let's go down to 1595. Boom, we're at 1595. We have some, oh, we have uh, uh, whatever this thing is. You can die thing. I love bacon as an ore. Like, bacon tools are as good as diamond. They don't seem to work as fast, but uh, they seem to last longer, and maybe that's just me, but... Dude, when I found that out, I was like, why have, been, why have I been wasting my tools... Why have I been wasting my diamond on tools? I could have been using all this bacon. So, yeah. Um... That's that. Let's uh, let's go back because again, this isn't this isn't about anything here. This is about the super high definition experience. What is this six? Okay, so it should be like ten minutes worth once I edit. Nah, uh, probably like eight minutes worth once I put the two together. That's fine. Um, yeah. So this was just a test video of the super high resolution video. Hopefully everything works out. Hopefully you can see this. And um, yeah, I may just be doing all of my future videos at this resolution because YouTube will put them down to 1080 anyways. So everybody who only has a 1080 screen can still watch it. But if you have greater than 1080, well, well, there you go, man. There you go. You can watch it in higher resolution. Next, I have to start filming at 60 frames a second. Yeah, that's not happening. That's pointless. Thanks for watching. And um yeah, I, I will I will uh, catch you guys around or something, man. Oh, don't forget to smash that like button and uh, decimate the subscribe button. Actually, don't decimate it because uh, it would look dumb then. It wouldn't be high as enough resolution. But yeah, do all that stuff. Um, bothy and 
Desgrasa would be immensely thankful if you subscribed and liked the video. So, you know, do that for them because, oh, and someone. And whatever this other person is, he's stuck behind a torch. So I can't tell. Um, but they'd all be super happy. Oh, and Moth. Everybody, they would just be, they'd be tickled pink. So just, just do it for them, you know. It's not for me, it's, it's for the viewers and for the people who happen to get their names on screen. Catch you next time.